The SMU Mustangs roster looks a lot different than it did last season. Half of the squad is filled with true freshmen, which has made the veteran experience this year even more vital. Retro junior Destiny Hives McRae is someone Coach Rompola has looked to this year to help get that team chemistry going. But it hasn't been an easy journey for Destiny, and in fact, this should have been her senior season. She was granted a medical redshirt after an unexpected obstacle she was forced to overcome last season. Last year, I had this really mysterious illness. It was like I woke up one morning and I could barely walk and I ended up in the hospital and it turns out I had like a staph infection circulating through my bloodstream. Completely random, they have no idea where it came from. So I actually ended up playing 10 games before that happened. I was able to sit the rest of the year and only because I played 10 games, I was able to get that year back. So now I'm a red shirt junior and that was definitely a tough obstacle because I had to learn to walk and run again and so now I'm 100% healthy and 100% back so I'm definitely blessed and appreciative of the opportunity to be here again so that was crazy. Sitting on the sidelines watching her team play wasn't easy for Destiny but looking back she realizes how much she was able to learn even through the tough times. It was so frustrating, um, especially because two of my best friends, Akil Simpson and Keena Mays, they were seniors and I would never get to play with them again, so that was a tough pill to swallow. But it was also, like I said, a blessing because I got to learn the game from the sideline. You know, you sit and you see things that you wouldn't normally see if you were actually playing. And I appreciate everything so much more, you know. Um, practice when I'm tired. I'm like, at least I can do this and be out here right now opposed to sitting on the sidelines. So it taught me a lot. When the game is taken away from you, even for a short bit of time, it's not easy to battle back on your own. Lucky for Destiny, she had a great amount of support surrounding her. I would definitely have to say I drew strength from my teammates and from my family and knowing that I have the opportunity to get better and not be content with my game uh, because I was at a point where, you know, I was satisfied. I hate to say that, but I was and not being able to play taught me so much more and I just know that my game has elevated so much to the next level because of that. So um, it taught me to be grateful if nothing else. Now Destiny is back and is in full health, but this year has posed different kinds of challenges, not individually, but as a team. I would have to say growing pains has to be the main term I can think of. Um, I've never played with so many young players and especially me being a captain and a leader. It's been difficult, challenging, but something I embrace because, I mean, this is what it takes, you know. Um, I accept the challenge. Oh, so many different personalities with so much talent as well. So I'm really excited to play with these girls and to like build relationships and it's been fun and exciting but still tough. Realizing the challenges that a young team is up against, Destiny has been working since the offseason with the freshmen to try to help get them up to speed. I guess it would have to be accepting the roles. You know, you come from high school and you're the star player, you get here and everyone else is just as good as you are. So letting them know like, hey, this is what you need to do and this is what I do and um, accepting me as a captain and uh, someone you can come to for questions, you know, learning all the plays, Rhonda's throwing things in very quickly. So um, I take the time to go over plays with them and um, just let them know what she's really looking for and what kind of program this is to help them buy into the system. On paper, it's been a tough one for the Mustangs this season, but young talent doesn't develop overnight. Expect big things to come for SMU in the seasons to come.